morning, Comrade Wiser. I'm Jillian Durand, and welcome to our remote edition of We Are Wiser, Week 5. This week, we have spring shout-outs as well as some additional fun and informative videos. On Wednesday, the Greenfield Youth Film Festival held their annual awards online. CWTV's own Cassidy Delp earned second place honors for her PSA. Yes, dude, I told you, I'm leaving right now. Bye, Mom, love you. Text me when I get there. I'm leaving right now. I'm leaving right now. So, nah, I can't. I can't. Like he's all. It's a crazy. I heard all day. <laughs> Miss, are you okay? Oh my gosh. So Yo, are you okay? Oh Bye, Mom. Love you. Text me when I get there. Yes, yes. Dude, I told you. I'm leaving right, right now. Right now. Yo, Yo, are you okay? I'm so sorry. I know things will never be the same. Tell me loss will never be replaced. I'm the reason you forgot to love. So to 
Go get it. Did some things I couldn't let choose. He refused to be the one who takes your heart. Go. I'm Haley Gamble. I'm a junior at Connor Weiser and if I'm going to be completely honest, I've tried filming this video multiple times and I couldn't get through it without showing my emotions. So if that happens, I apologize. I'm not normally like this, um, but the people I'm most thankful for are my friends easily. Uh, this quarantine has been very difficult for me, not just because of the self-isolation, but Due to some personal reasons um and my friends have just kind of helped lifted me up um kind of helped me appreciate things i have in life and just made me a happier person This is Mrs. Rathman, and I want to give a shout out from the entire counseling office to all the CWHS students for working so hard these past few weeks. Keep up the great work. I also want to give a shout out to nature, friends, and family. Everyone is aware of the effect that coronavirus has had on our daily lives. In this time, we should be thankful for the essential workers that keep America moving. I would like to give a special shout out to all the nurses and doctors that are risking their health to treat and save others in this time. Specifically, my mother has been working many long hours at Reading Hospital to keep the people of our community healthy and safe. We should be thankful for these nurses because like many others, Christy is a wife, a mother, and a lifesaver. Thank you for all the nurses and doctors that are risking their lives to keep us safe. I'd like to give a shout out to both of my parents, Jason and Stephanie Drobnik. They've always been there for me when times got tough. They've always provided for me and they've always supported me. And due to the coronavirus pandemic and the quarantine, I've been able to spend a lot of extra time with both of them. And I'm really thankful for all the memories that we've already made and will continue to make. I want to conclude by just saying thank you. Thank you for shaping me into the person I am today. Thank you for teaching me how to be respectful. Thank you for teaching me to never take anything for granted and to live in the moment. And thank you for raising me right. I can never ask for a better pair to call my parents. And I'm so beyond thankful for both of you. Scouts, popping in to say and give a shout out to all our awesome students. Go Scouts! I would like to shout out all the teachers that are working really hard right now during these difficult times, including my mom. She's a librarian in Exeter, and ever since the lockdown started, she's had to learn everything about Schoology. She's been working really hard these past couple of weeks, creating new lessons for the kids, and so I hope everyone's appreciating how much effort all our teachers are putting into schoolwork right now, even though a lot of people might not like it. I respect all the teachers working right now and know that it's really hard to move over to cyber schooling. So I hope all the students also understand the difficulties and will show appreciation to their own teachers.
I'd like to give a special shout out to all the interns this year. I know all of you were expecting to be out at your workplace doing hands-on work, and now you're working remotely on workplace readiness. I especially want to thank the seniors this year who have given so many great suggestions and a lot of good feedback. And some of them are Elise Cole, Maddie Fisher, Sarah Maurer, Bree Haig, Gracie George, Morgan and her sister Nicole Kopsik, Peyton Menser, Sarah Frash, and Kylie Grosh. Thank you all so much for making this a great semester. Love you all. I'm thankful for Mrs. Angstadt because she's always checking up on me, sending me cute, positive messages, and reminds me to do my assignments when I forget. But overall, she is a great person and I love her. I'd like to give a shout out and thank everyone that works in the hospital, especially the people that come in contact with the COVID-19 patients. Because I work in the hospital, I see how emotionally and physically drained that everyone is. And um, it's really hard, but yet they stay so positive and they keep their heads up and they're always smiling and it's it's just amazing how much they help people but also stay so positive while they're out on the front lines and trying to stay healthy themselves and it's truly amazing that everything that they do and I love how throughout the day we'll hear probably about 10 announcements go off saying um that a patient has recovered from COVID-19 and has been discharged. And it's such an amazing thing to hear and really makes everyone happy because we know that we're going to get through this and everyone's going to stay positive and we're all going to recover from everything. And it, it's just amazing. Hi, Wiser family. Just want to give a quick shout out to say how proud I am of everybody and how hard you're working and it's going to pay off. Can't wait to see everybody in the fall and stay healthy. Bye. Very thankful for my family at this time. I'm just thankful that my mom and dad and all my sisters can we can still be together and safe and healthy. That my aunt and my uncle and my cousins are safe and healthy. And that my grandma is staying home and she is safe and healthy. thankful that we have each other during this time even if some even if we're not physically together we're still virtually together and that's all I could ask for. Hi Scouts! I just want to give a shout out to all the wonderful teachers that I work with. You are doing amazing things for our kids and I'm so blessed to know all of you. Um, and, and a shout out to every one of our students because you are doing great things um, in trying times and wow, I'm just blessed to know all of you. Um, I miss you all and, and just keep doing all the work that you're doing. Um, take care everyone and I hope to see you soon. Johnson and the person that I'm going to shout out is well the people that I'm going to shout out is my grandparents um, they currently live in a retirement home up in York and um, they're not allowed to leave their house and nobody's allowed to go in their house and like interact with them 
but um, me and my mom and my sister, we went up there and they gave us like six homemade uh, face mask things. Mine's in my car right now, I don't have it. But um, yeah, my grandmother's been making them. So um, I just like want to shout her out and uh, appreciate what she's doing for everyone in the community to help us stop the spread of corona. It was nice to go up there and um, see them and make sure that they're still doing well, you know, they're happy. They were just playing cards. My Nana had her, uh, her uh, sweater with cards on it, <laughs> so. Uh, that was funny. Um, so yeah, shout out to Nana and Pop Pop. What's up? So today I want to give a shout out to all my teammates and friends. I want to give a shout out to them because they was always there for me through my ups and downs. My friends taught me what real friends was because like, um, they know when I'm having a bad day and a good day, and for a person like me, when I'm having a bad day, I don't show it, you know, I try to keep it inside, but my, um, friends, they always, like, realize, like, when I'm not in a good mood, I don't know how, but they just know, they, they know, like, something's off, and, like, they force me to talk to them, they be like, come on, I'm here for you, I'm here to talk if you need me, you know? Everybody needs somebody to talk to, so it's good to have friends like that. I enjoy going out with my friends, taking trips, and doing a lot of fun things. And with the team, especially with cross country, it was more like a family than a team, you know. And I never had a team that pushed me so hard that make me a better athlete. And also friends, they supported me coming to my track meets. I can go on and on for days about the friends, support, and teammates that I had, but you know, I got a limit on this video, so I'm going to drag and try to keep it. But yeah, I'm in this video here, so thanks for watching. For spring shout out week, I wish I could shout out all my friends because they're all the greatest. But above all, Mackenzie Donatelli has helped me get through this the most. For those of you who don't know, Mackenzie and I have been best friends for about six years. We love each other so much and do everything together. Literally everything. We're always together. And as much as I wish I could be quarantining with her, she's basically been working every single day to provide for her family and siblings. She works so hard and on top of that is preparing for college. But despite all of that, she still manages to call me and talk to me every single day. She's just really been helping me get through the rough days and help me see the silver lining. So thank you so much, Mackenzie. I hope you liked your spring shout out. I love you. I have to dedicate this time to thank the nurses, doctors, teachers, counselors. I know it's hard for everybody in the situation we're currently in, but thank you nurses and doctors for putting work in day in and day out. Um, I know it must be hard going home, especially to your family and having to isolate yourselves from them because you work with so many people with this virus and you don't want to take the risk of them getting sick as well. Um, thank you teachers for being so lenient towards us students because we're all new to this online classes. And um, thank you for answering any questions or concerns we may have about our work and grades. And um, thank you counselors for helping any students who are stressed or feeling down about having no more high school, especially the seniors who aren't going to be able to return for another year of high school. I know they're especially sad because I'm a senior myself and all my friends are sad. So thank you. So for this week's video, we're supposed to talk about people that we are thankful for or grateful for. So to start out, I would say that I'm very thankful that my whole family is safe right now and we're all healthy. 
And for the people that I'm thankful for, it would have to be these the people go out workers. every day and risk their lives to make sure that we all have what we need. People in the grocery stores and in the health facilities, they work hour shifts just to make sure that we're all safe and get what we need. Without all these essential workers going out and risking their lives, we wouldn't be able to survive this virus. I'm very thankful that these people really stepped up during a time of need when we are all struggling. They're still going out and getting work done and making sure that we could get through this together. So to all the essential workers out there, I just want to thank you for everything that you're doing and for helping us during this time of need. And now a message from our CW musical director, Hope Opaik. Hi everyone, I'm Hope Opaik, the Conrad Weiser High School musical director. I wanted to give everyone an update on this year's production of Les Miserables School Edition. It is still our intent to perform our show in whatever way that may be possible. We hope to celebrate the 60th anniversary of Conrad Weiser musicals and share that celebration with all of you. At this time, there are still many variables to be considered, such as taking care of things like academic needs and graduation for our seniors, as well as the upcoming scheduled renovations at the high school. So once we know a little bit more information, we'll be better able to figure out when it may be possible to perform our show. This week, the governor is scheduled to outline his plans to reopen the state and that will certainly give us a little bit more information so that we can begin to make plans. Certainly, we want everyone to stay safe and healthy at home. And as soon as possible, if possible, we look forward to seeing you all at Les Miserables School Edition. Thanks so much.
my sweater Rainy day weather Yesterday my pockets fat Today they looking fatter I might cost some big rings Big rings like Saturn You can do anything Yes, you matter I got hurricane wrist Looking like a disaster Yes, we blowing up like Did I master? Life they count money slow Then blow it faster Outer space can't really get much blacker Crispy like donuts Do some donuts be on double I count again, swear, feel like deja vu I be counting bands by myself, feeling visible I got haters quiet, I can't hear a single syllable Big flex, baby 98 Yeah, Burberry on my sweater Rainy day weather Yesterday my pockets fat, today they looking fatter I might call some big rings, big rings like Saturn You can do anything, yes you matter Burberry on my sweater Pockets fat today, they looking fatter. I might call some big rings, big rings like Saturn. You can do anything, yes, you matter. I just bought a ruby ring, it looked like a ring pop. Looking at shooting stars on the rooftop. Everywhere we pull up, they say that's a new spot. Money on my mind, I got bands like a what a thought. Wrist look like a hurricane. Rainy day weather on my chain. Burberry on my sweater. That's a stain, I put it in the watch, but it's still just not the same I got haters quiet, I can't hear a single syllable Big flex, yeah, be 98 Have yeah, berry on my sweater, rainy day weather Yesterday my pockets fat, today they looking fatter I might call some big rings, big rings like Saturn You can do anything, yes you matter Have berry on my sweater Pockets fat today, they looking fatter. I might call some big rings, big rings like Saturn. You can do anything, yes, you matter. Thank you so much for watching, Scouts. Make sure to have a great week, wash your hands, and practice social distancing.